Karen Jekley Live. Hi guys, in this video we are going to discuss optimal page replacement. So guys, if you have seen my previous video, we discussed FIFO and we discussed LRU. LRU was least recently used algo. And in LRU, what we used to do is we used to replace the page. We used to look back and we used to select the page which we did not use from the long time. All right. Now in optimal page replacement, it is opposite of LRU. How it works, we will discuss it. Now again, I have cache, I'm in my cache, three spaces and this is my page reference string. So I need seven cache empty, I put seven. I need zero cache empty, I put zero. I need one cache empty, I put one. Now comes two. Now comes two and my cache is already full. Now which page should I replace? Now in LRU, we used to look back. In optimal page replacement, we have to look into the future. We have to look into the future. Now in the future, right, take these three pages, seven, zero, one, Look for the page which you do not need for the longest time in future. For the longest time in future. Zero we need here. Okay. Now three right now we do not need to replace it. Again we zero we need here. First we need zero here. Then we need zero here. Right. Keep on looking. Then one we do not need for the long time and seven also we do not need for the long time so which page should be replaced so we do not need one we do not need seven so what we do is right now we will replace seven so two zero one again we have zero zero is already there so cash remains in two zero one now comes three now comes three again we look into the future again we look into the future from three again we look so zero we need again after three the next page which we need is zero then four we do not have it then after zero the next page we need out of here is two okay so the which page out of this we do not need in future that is page number one. See, we do not need one. So what we get here is two, zero, three. Okay, replaced. Then we have zero already there. So no replacement needed. Then comes four. Then comes four. Now, again, look for these pages which we need in the future. We need two. Yes, we need three also. So which page we do not need out of this? That is zero. So four replaces that zero. So two, four, three. Two, four, three. Then two is already there. Two, four, three. Then again, two, four, three is already there. Now guys, if you see optimal approach, in optimal approach, only two page replacements are done. Isn't it? So in FIFO, we had many page replacements. In LRU, we had many page replacements. Now, if you look at optimal page replacements, page replacement algo, we did only two replacement and we managed our cache. So that's why we call it as optimal, right? It is the best approach, but it is expensive. Why it is expensive? Because we should, we need to keep the track of our future page needs which with which uh, comes with extra which comes with some extra calculations right so that's why this approach is a bit expensive but it is optimal only if with two replacements we managed the full cash so guys this these were the page replacement algos so guys if you like my videos please subscribe to my channel you know we need your support and for more it related video then also please subscribe to my channel okay so till then stay tuned thank you